Okay, so I just wanted to come out right quick and pull back this tarp and see what things are looking like under it so far. And it's looking like it's, I mean, you see, this is what I'm afraid of. That's gonna, let's take a look. I did put some, uh, some worms out here. Um, when I, when I, right before I tarped this, I dumped out a bucket of, uh, of red wigglers. Not seeing any of the, any of the worms, which is a little confusing, but, uh, that looks like it's just straight cocoa right there. See, that's what I'm trying to kill off. That stuff... And it, I mean, it's, it's just so aggressive and really just a pain in my backside. And it, it's everywhere. I mean, it's like, it's almost like this tarp's not even been here for the past two and a half months. Maybe not two and a half. I don't, I'm not sure. Not seeing much life under here. But, uh, I mean, the compost looks like compost. It's, uh, let me see if I can get a, a shovel or just a, a little hand trowel and uh, dig down a little bit. And I'll put some compost over here, too. This is just tossed out here nothing nothing serious I just uh let's see what that soil looks like I mean it looks like it's gonna grow some really nice plants I mean I'm not I'm not worried about the actual health of the soil it's it's gonna do what it's supposed to do but I'm really hoping that the rest of this grass dies off because I mean this is this is the whole reason for for buying this tarp and getting out here and uh keeping this covered that's just that's just a pain I just put the I just had it in my hand. I don't know where it went that quick. Where in the hell? Anyway, I'm gonna hurry up and get this tarp back on here. I just wanted to uh, to check it out and see uh, what the progress was looking like. Um, still a little concerned. This this tarp might have to stay out here. Uh, for a full calendar year, at least until uh, next fall, um, you wanna you wanna get this stuff covered while it's actively trying to grow, and it'll it'll eventually fizzle out. It's just a matter of how long and uh, how much uh, it'll actually you know if if it gets any light. Then it'll store that as energy, and uh, and we'll be doing this, you know, just kind of endlessly for the rest of our days. But I, I really want to get this to where I'm not I'm not dealing with these grasses anymore before I go trying to plant anything else out here. It's just it's not worth it to stress myself out. In uh, Texas in the summer, you know, you, you don't want to be out here. Uh, pulling weeds Get these blackberries out of the way Jeez Okay All right So yeah, um At least until 
until we warm up and this stuff starts trying to grow again i'm just gonna i'm just gonna leave the tarp out i'll do my container peppers and uh and keep growing over here in in this bed uh what i can you know i'll, I'll put another uh cattle panel uh right here i'll put one down here and then uh grow some tomatoes in the center and probably some cucumbers along here uh to to grow up the panels uh i think i'm gonna put some uh some elephant ears in that bed I've got some cabbages that are uh well some of them are starting to head up a little bit uh some spinach that i seeded in here not too long ago carrots and cilantro the carrots are actually doing better than I thought they would. There was one over here the other day that I accidentally dug up. And uh, I, was, I was out here pulling some, uh, some of this hen bit out and, uh, and some of the grasses. And I accidentally pulled up a carrot. And I came over, uh, pried the soil uh, to the side, and uh, stuck it back in ground. And I, it's either that one or that one. I'm not sure. But... You know, we'll have some decent carrots here in the next as close this stuff's growing probably another uh another six to eight months this stuff is just growing so slow now we got some more spinach popped up it's probably all gonna die because we've got uh temperature supposed to be in the teens mid-teens uh next weekend of course that was supposed to be this weekend or at least that's how i understood it um and that's all changed so you know there's no telling what the what the forecast will be um but let's go look inside and uh talk about some of our 